Hi guys, welcome back to another episode. Um, if this is your first time, welcome. So great to have you here. Hit the subscribe button below and um, follow us through because this is, we do some really uh, fun yet, yeah, I don't know, maybe I'm just crazy. And uh, that's why people come, keep coming back is because I'm a loopy loop. Um, but pretty much what we're gonna be doing today is we're gonna be covering five ways to Fill up that blank space in your planner, in your bullet journal, or even your undated planner. I'm going to be using my Archer and Olive undated planner today, and I'm just going to use one page just to show you five different ways to fill up that extra space. Let's get started. Alright, getting started with our Archer and Olive Undated Planner, we're opening up to just a pretend page and we're going to be filling up these blank spaces with some no, general stuff. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to fill one space up with stickers. We're going to use the entire space and we're going to use as many stickers as possible. Just putting as many quotes and cute little embellishments as we can into that one little box. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to make a meetings notes section. What a simple way to keep those meeting notes in one place and also a good use of that extra space if you don't know what to do with it. If you haven't already, tell us in the comments below how you fill up your empty space in your planner. The next thing we're going to do is sketch noting and this is kind of a combination of sketching and note taking. You can use it to doodle in spaces or even just keep track of memories for the days, appointments or things that you want to take particular note of. It's really simple to do and you don't need um, extra super artistic skills to be able to do it either. Alright, really simply, we're going to add in a memory keeping page by just painting in a bit of these blocks. I'm going to use up the, mon the Friday and the weekend to take up space and use my cute little photo. Finally, we're just going to add a simple quote into the block. What a great way to fill it up. As you can see, we had tons of fun today. Feel free to join us over on Facebook, Instagram, and Pinterest. We look forward to seeing you in the future and hope you had a great time today. Thank you.